Yeah, so when we came earlier today, this side, the my left, will be on your right. If you're looking from the outside, from the other side, I'm looking from this side. The fence was very low. It was lower than this one. It was looking bad. Because those who started this work earlier, a few years ago, never did a good job. All right? If you see this this fence, this side of the fence is inside, it's up. And the reason is because of the door that they're gonna be having here. There's a door that's gonna be right here. But this side of the fence was very low because this place is lower. So it was really low, it was looking bad. But now the masoner did a great job here. We asked him to put a few levels that were gonna match the level of the other side. And he did exactly that. So now we have this and this matching. Matching, you can see it, right? So now we have both of them looking the same. That's an excellent job he did. Now he's gonna add more, at least two more layers or something to the entire place, all the way to the end. That's what he's gonna do for us. Hopefully he will be finishing on Friday. Um, so we're looking forward to that. He's a hardworking man. He got his uh, principal guys that are working with him. There's one right there. So, and there is another guy right there too. So these guys, they are good people, I'm telling you. So he's still working here. And this is coming through the fence, you know, through the front door. That's what he's doing. So there he is. He's still doing some work. He's trying to fix a stuff that he will stand on to put the next the next two levels up. That's what he's doing. You gotta do it in a way so that the one in there won't fall. At least it will be it will grip it. So that's why he's nailing the stuff there. So he's done a great job here. That's the entrance. So now the entrance has gone up. You see, it looks so nice here. This is the entrance. You're gonna add another two. And then that's gonna match. Now you can see the level, they are up. And this is the entrance of the house. So that's a great job he's doing. He's gonna do more. This is wonderful, right? Yeah, you're gonna add another two because if you notice this side of the fence is shorter and this side of the fence is higher. And in order to make them the same because we don't want people jumping over the fence, climbing over the fence. So what are we gonna do? We're gonna make sure that this side too is as high as this side, the other side, this side. And then also over at the gate, the entrance. See the entrance there? Yeah. So that's a great, great thing going on there. I did show you the front of the house today, um, but this is what is happening here right now. They are trying to put, they are putting the two, the two um, um, levels there. You can see it there. You see there. And then all of the pillars. You see the pillars. There are eight pillars here. I did mention it to you, but I'm so excited that I have to say it again. So this is where we are. Um, yesterday, the, the people, they brought those from... The, the, the other group of people who claim that this land is his, they brought a surveyor yesterday to survey this land. But they did, I don't know if they did it outside of the land, or but I saw them inside of the fence surveying. And I believe that if they were to survey our land or they came to survey our land, those who own land adjacent to us should have been here when they were surveying. But they came and said, oh, the land, they told us to come from lands and mines. Or, um, which I don't believe, um, but that's what they say. And they went in our yard and then surveyed to us that we had X number of, of, of acres over here. So that's what they said. And because of that, it is, it's becoming a, a problem. It's becoming a problem. Um, for us in a way then after they got to surveying and we were not the one who invited them to do it They wanted us to pay them Isn't that funny? They wanted us to pay them. They came 
from their own self came and said that they wanted to survey the land because they want to know how much land we have. But then they came and asked us to pay them again after surveying the land and we were the one who sent for them. But you see, that's where what goes on there. But we decided, no, we didn't send for you guys, so we sorry, go. And then they left. So we don't know what's going to happen. We are hoping that the other guy, the man who sold the land to us, should be meeting with our lawyer today and this evening actually and we will want to hear what happened whether he has a deed mother's deed or whatever deed he has um to be able to show it so um the people other group of people when they don't have theirs and then we'll see what we can say about that but you know what if they win and they have the land they own it we're going to work with them whoever owns the land um if it's the guy who bought it from we already have the deed to it if these people who claim that the land is theirs and we go to court or whatever and they win the case we're going to all work with them because we have invested a lot here we cannot and i must emphasize we cannot let it go because this is our dream house we love this house we drew it ourselves and we are here on the ground making sure that it is built the way we want it built that's one thing i'll tell you so and it's working out exactly the way we want it so that's what's happening right now you coming? So as you can see over there, that place was open and they shut it down today. They closed it up. That's what happened. So now there was a passageway for people who used to pass here but now they seal it up so they will have to put steel wall over here as well no more and then they're gonna they cast it when they cast this place then there'll be nowhere you won't be able to see through there but for now they just closed it today so they are putting the finish finish touch finishing touches to the fence so i'm going i'm going to show you around where what they've done here so finishing touches the fence is about done and then we have to fix the top i think you can see they left some steel rods still shooting up because we might want to carry the fence up a little higher but for now we're going to leave here as they at this and then travel back to the states So you see over there, they also build the wall up, put the steel roll in, and what you're going to do now is to cast it, and then you're going to put a gate up. So those who used to come from where I showed you earlier that they just built up, they will now pass around the fence, go around from there, and walk this way, all the way here, and then come through here to fetch water, to fetch water, because that's the only good water they have around here for drinking, the well we have in the yard here. So this is what it is. They just put the steel roll in, and then um see they put the walls up so sooner or later we have we're hoping to have this gate in before we leave we're just going to put a temporary gate here or zen gate until we ready to ready focus on this fence we're just putting it up now but we're going to focus on it in the near future very soon to try to finish it up so you see you got to cast this so that's the land over there it's heading all the way down and that's the house we're going to leave it like this um, until we return um, to the states and then we're going to come back here to Liberia soon in the next few months 
to try to carry this house um, to where we'll be pleased. So that's where we are right now. So you can see, that's the Porsche standing over there. So that's what it is. Our porches will be straight, the pillars. That's what we're doing. People across there are just trying to find 40 seams because surveying the man's land in the fence. I've never seen that before, but that's what it did. And then they went else to pay them. Sorry for laughing, but it was so funny to me because I don't think it was our, um, our business to pay them, but that's why they thought maybe that doesn't happen like that. Yeah. So that's what it is. He's already at work. He's already building, putting the next one up. He's already doing it. Yep. That's what he's doing. This is um, your show just for you. And as I said, I'm gonna keep showing you the day-to-day -day development and improvement of this property. So I wanna say thanks to you, my subscribers, for returning and being consistent. And to those of you who have not subscribed, I wanna say, could you do that for me? I have a lot. This is something that um, we're hoping that by tomorrow or Friday, they will be done with this level and then we will want to spend some time doing other stuff here, shopping and taking care of other stuff before we leave for the States. So that's what we, we're trying to do here. So as you can see there, there are a lot of work that has been done and it's been done. So we're so happy that things have improved this far since we came just over a month. A little while a month and this is what we have already on the ground. So we're hoping the next time we come, this property will be at another, another level. So thank you for watching. And this is your man, Sonny Wayne Fella. I will be seeing you in the next video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.